Mwishe. Kuhanga simu. The atmosphere at Namgongo was joyous as Father Muwonge received the 20 pilgrims from Bushenyi district who began their trek on the 10th of this month, only getting to Namgongo on the 23rd of May. Having walked for over 400 kilometers on a journey to memorize the love that was shared by the martyrs, the pilgrims could hardly believe they had made it to Namgongo. They all burst into rhythmic singing, not believing their eyes that the journey had come to an end and their mission complete. The parish priest, Father Joseph Mukasamonge, could not contain his excitement, as this has become a ritual that just gets better with every passing year. Indeed, I feel very much privileged to always receive pilgrims to the Holy Land, allow me to call it, of Namgongo. The Uganda Martyrs Land. Most notable in this group, however, is Musei Bernardo Tibianje, an eight seven year old who has been making this pilgrimage for the last sixty five years. He says his life has never been the same again ever since he began making these pilgrimages. <laughs> Just like Tibianje, several other pilgrims are expectant that their prayer requests will be granted after the pilgrimage, while others say they dedicate the journey to prayer for peace in Uganda. I'm physically fit, very stable, healthy, as you see me. Nothing has happened to me and my fellow colleagues whom I come with. The Uganda, the Uganda martyrs were Christian converts killed on the orders of Uganda's Kabakamwanga II in 1886. Harit Namkasa, WPS TV, Namgongo.